Special definitely wasn't working in the space because exactly. you separated it and there's no way to put it back together. Exactly. It can't find its way back together, so <laughs> it's going to go out somewhere else. It's, okay, great. Okay, so let's have a look at, uh, at this. Before we get into furniture placement, things of that nature, we want to talk about uh, the two doors that you have leading into the space. Although absolutely beautiful and charming, mm -hmm. we're kind of thinking maybe um, one of them can, uh, can be removed. Reason being is that if we go to your floor plan the way it is now, you've got one large door here, you've got another door here, and another door here. Now, when these doors swing, you're going to see we lose a lot of square footage. So the one door that we would like you to not have is the door that enters in. It's the main door into the, into the living room. It's the one that's facing the fireplace. But we would love you to keep these two doors here because we want you to keep them open at all times so they actually don't have to come in and out of the room. So the flow will be great. Because we think they're so beautiful. They add a beautiful charm to the space. So we want to keep that layering there. And it also frees you up when you look at this. This wall right here, this now, because this, this door is gone, this wall here is your main wall. That's great for lots of people who are working there if you want. Just keep this wall free and the door is not this hard work. Beautiful decorative chairs facing into it. So you have all of the 